everyone, welcome back to another Exos Heroes episode. So today I'm going to review my main account for April 2021. So let's start this one with my existing roster. So let's go up and um, start with more or less the core of my team. So again, as you've all known, I've been using Wasted Red ever since. Uh, not really ever since, but probably around five or six months back so i've shifted to to wasted red um my main faction basically is wasted red and the star of my team redly is actually from wasted red so um in terms of their unleash potential again for redly uh he is actually full um Gear is good, even um, uh, Fate Core, or sorry, for, for en en enhancement of, uh, of Fate Core, he is actually good at 16. So, more or less, my most, uh, most you know, powerful hero to date in terms of, again, he does everything for my team, for my PvP team, defense, offense, support, you name it, he has it, and more or less... I'm just waiting for him to be level 100. So now he's at 97. I'm slowly, you know, getting him up to 100. So hopefully I could be there in a couple of, in a month or two, probably. I'm not sure. Um, it's really rare to look for, um, look for level up, uh, what do you call this? Level up tomes. So it's really, really, it's really scarce at this point. And I have a lot of, you know, heroes to level up as well. So I hope I get to have him at uh, 100 within a month or two. Next would be Annie. So I've invested I've invested a lot in Annie ever since, ever since I, start, I started the game. And uh, recently she's dropped out of the meta. So I'm actually thinking twice on using her. But again, I won't... I won't really, um, I won't really change her, what they call this, I won't strip her of her gear, um, and if ever a niche potential, I won't, because I'm still using her in PvP tag. So, again, right now for PvP, I'm still using her, but again, I might shift to FC Maggie, so I'll discuss FC Maggie in a while. So again, she's my second um, most powerful hero here in my roster. And the third one would be FC Garf. So right now, I'm actually looking to transcend FC Garf. Um, that is what I lack from her. Um, Unleash Potential is also complete. Um, I still need FC Garf to be at level 100 as well, together with FC Redley. But again, I still have to transcend her. And I don't have copies of Garf as of now. So hopefully within the next few few weeks or a month i can finish her off so again a very solid um solid hero in my account solid in pvp as well as in pve okay next would be well everybody's been leveling up schmidt or fc schmidt so because he brings a lot in terms of turn reset in terms of you know more damage to a, a counter, sorry, to, to damage immunity. Um, I actually like him because of the turn reset mostly. So I, I'm, I'm, I'm actually still, I'm actually still uh, working on his signature force. And again, I'm also working on his kit. So again, leveling up, I just fusion, I, I just tr transcended him recently to plus three. So I'm bringing up as well to 96 again. Um, tomes are very scarce at this point, so more or less, I do hope to to level it, level him up, and also finish his uh, signature force. Um, I do hope that the upcoming FC, sorry, FC Awaken Zeon is good, so that I could probably try to build my Vagabond Nation already because I'm investing a lot in the signature force as it is. So it's a waste that if it's only um, FC Schmidt that is good there. Okay, next would be FC Janai. So more or less a background again. I did I did um, level up FC Janai before I because I was using um, Astoria's Republic. Then I transferred to Wasted Red because again it's really hard to create a Astoria's Republic core team 
they don't have that much of a good healer or a good support. Um, more or less, only, only Shell is good here in terms of support. But again, for 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 health, for um, uh, uh, HP regeneration or healing, they're not. You know, they're not. It's not their. You know, it's it's not their uh, strong suit. So more or less. But again, Jinai, I'm still keeping her because. Um, she heads actually um, uh, the next best team in my tag PvP, so that is why she's still here, and I I actually like her. Um, my second team is actually composed of FC Jinai, FC Shell, FC Schmid, Dorka, and the other one is FC Adams. Yeah, that's for that that that's for PvP tag. My main team for PV PvP tag would be Rudley, Annie, Garf. Um, I think it's Ramji, and the other one is Iris, if I'm not mistaken. Or I have it wrong. <laughs> I'll show you later what my team right now in PvP tag anyway is. So let's move on further. For Ramji, again, he's a mainstay. I'm planning to put up a Wasted Red team. Bringing in back Rudley, so Rudley, uh, sorry, uh, Ramji, so Rudley, Annie, Garf, Ramji, and FC Maggie. I'm actually going to build up my FC Maggie because I, I haven't built her up. It's been a long time and I've prioritized a lot of heroes before her. So again, Ramji is here to stay because I'm, I'm, I'm mixing him in and out of my teams. I might actually use Rera. <coughs> Rera in my PvP team as well it, to replace um, to replace Annie. So uh, Morris, it would be Rudley, Garf, Schmid, Ramji, and Rera. That could be it. Or to replace Annie, it would be Maggie. So again, I have a lot of mix and match right now with with my with my heroes. It's it's a luxury actually to have a lot of good heroes leveled up and additional potential is actually out of the way. So again, for Ramji, you have their um, finished Unleashed Potential. And again, he's actually one of my super subs in my game or my sixth map. So for Iris, Iris, again, she is in and out in my main PvP team. But again, she is actually still there for my tag PvP. And again, um, Unleashed Anish Potential for Iris is actually complete as well. So next would be FC Shell. Again, as you heard it earlier, FC Shell is in my... She's in my... What do you call this? My tag PvP team together with Janai. They're the second best team. And again, um, finished with her Anish Potential. Um, next would be FC Tantalo. FC Tantalo actually was a project that I put on hold for a while because... You know that um, he's going to encounter Schmidt. He's actually not, you know, going to be a liability in the team. So I, I, I put a halt in on his, um, on his unleash potential. But I still bring him in tag PVP. Okay. Um, the one that I'm that I'm concentrating right now to build the the, the trio for 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 Storage Republic would be Adams. Adams is. I'm currently building up his um, his uh, unleash potential. He's my project currently because again I saw the potential between the three of them together. FC Shell, FC Janai, and FC Adams. Um, very good trio and synergy for them three. The rest you could just mix and match with the other nations. But again, he's my current project. Take note, current project for the meantime. Jean. Um, I might decide to strip Gene of uh, his gear and probably downgrade his gear. I'm not using him in PvP or PvP tag currently. I did happen to have an experiment last time with him, but I'm more comfortable using the others rather than him. Um, Unleash potential for Gene is actually also missing. That is why I can't bring him um for tag pvp he is a good substitute for for shell or for fc iris for for those who have barriers but again in 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 the team that i built he's actually just there 
to fill a spot but right now all spots are really filled so i'm actually planning to dismantle this hero probably okay next would be fc Bathory. so Bathory has been in my mainstay he is uh, she is in my third team right now together with shufraken and valentina um together with talia and tantalo that is actually my third team so more or less again a mainstay but i haven't really worked on her anish potential as you see it's still closed <laughs> So a you know a work in progress in the future, um, but now she's helping me in tag PvP. Talia as well is in tag PvP for my third team, um, together with Shufrak and Tantalo and Bathory. So a mainstay still in my team. So we're at we're here already. So Dorka is actually in. The second team with Janai and Shell, Schmid, and FC Adams. So I have to tinker with with her. I haven't I haven't checked if her attack is higher than no, it's 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 lower than Janai. So again, I'm I'm actually just waiting for her fate core. Hopefully she has one already so that I would have an easier, you know, easier time bumping up her attack stat for her HP regen to kick in. Again, she's in my second team, and she is actually there um, just for her heal regeneration. Next would be FC Shufraken. So FC Shufraken, um, one of the best heroes that I have actually in terms of North One Frosty, um, third team for tag PvP. But again, I haven't, you know, I don't have the the resources for 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 me to open or unleash his potential i'm now focusing basically on the, the three nations so i have you have uh, my primary nation would be would be wasted red next would be in terms of signature force would be um vagabond and the third would be a stories republic so it leaves me a lot of although the signature force for for northward frosty is actually at is good already but again he um they are the fourth nation in terms of priority right now so again um no anish potential same with valentina although the gear is excellent already no anish potential as well so as you can see it is still closed and more or less that is actually my main team although this is 16, 1, 4, 8, 12, 6, uh, 16. The, in the 16, only Gene is not being used here. So that leaves me with 15 for tag PvP. But again, as as I said, um, guys, I've been working with a lot of projects right now in terms of heroes. So Adams is there as, as one of the main. But actually, I'm also <clears throat> working on FC Rera. Because I had the mistake of awakening her with green. So I will be awakening her with all red so that I could bump up her HP and awaken her with red, then probably um, equip her with green. So that is my you know my um, my plan for her. She's in the works as well. Haven't really unleashed potential her again, it's still closed. <clears throat> Actually, I did the same fault or I did the same mistake with FC Bathory. Bathory, I did awaken before with all green. I, 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 I just happened to change her, her, her awaken to all red. So again, the next one would be FC Rera. Because before, before Storage Republic, I used to bring, um, bring Greenland as well. So basically from Greenland, I went to Stories, then I went to sorry from from North Van Frosty, Greenland, Stories, and Wasted Red. So basically I stayed in Wasted Red um up until now, but I did shift well, from one nation to another. That is why their their signature forces are actually kinda kinda average and good already. So Rara is one of my projects. Um, Maggie is one as well, definitely because she is with um, Wasted Red and I need her. Either Rara or Maggie will replace Annie in my new team. 
And my pet, <laughs> my pet would be Sabrina. Um, if you guys notice, I actually was able to get her exclusive weapon. Don't ask me how many zes I spent for that one. Um, I wouldn't tell you guys. <laughs> but again, she looks great. I'm trying to, I'm going to try to bring her in tag PvP. I'm going to have her built. She's with Raced Red as well. So I don't, at this point, I don't care if she doesn't have core memory. As long as, as I get um, her fusion up, probably another, another um, Fate Core 2, probably Fate Core uh, Fusion 2, Fusion 3 would be okay. Um, I actually uh, pitted her banner, but I'm thinking of going at another round of summons for FC Sabrina. Um, after the th um after the Wednesday announcement on who will be who will be um, out on Thursday, I'm not sure if if it's going to be a Black Fate Core this Thursday, especially if it's going to be Naomi the guy. I wouldn't pull for for that banner. I would pull for for her banner for for FC Sabrina's banner. So. Well, I, I still have to, you know, to wait for Wednesday to, to see who is, who's going to be launched. So, more or less, um, she is actually... Looks good. Looks good. Very nice. Very nice costume. Very nice sword, actually. Very nice design. Um, very sleek for an assassin. Okay. So, more or less, those are the heroes that I'm considering. The rest... Um, are just my mainstays up to level 75, level 90. Um, almost all of the FCs I have, except for, are, I think, one, two, or three. Um, but again, these are my core heroes. I haven't been using Zeon, Barak. I haven't been using, I have been using Leombe or Otard. But again, out of the 16, <clears throat> this is the top 16 here with Valentin the last. What I'm using actually are going to improve again. After them would be Rara, Maggie, and FC Sabrina. Okay. I'll take you guys to um, my signature force on how I built this one. So, my again, as, as I've mentioned, um, signature force right now is kind of all over the place. So, Lenombe not my strong suit. So, it's just at uh, 1.3. Greenland, I am at 1... No, it's at 2.1. So, again, um, I've used Greenland in the past. It's at 2.1. Estoris Republic, I'm also at 2.1c. So, more or less, they're in equal footing. For Wasted Red, I'm actually finished with this one. So, I'm at uh, 3.4 already. For North 1 Frosty, I am at... 1.4 and uh, <clears throat> for Brun I am at 2.1 next would be Vagabond so Vagabond I am at 2.4 already nearing the third level already so hopefully I complete this one as soon as possible so that I could go back to either Astoris or to Greenland for Signature Force. For Saint West, I don't have at least one. So I am not considering um, Carrie as the moment or, or, or Saint West as part of my priorities as of the moment, probably after a year. After a year, I could probably build um, Saint West if they're viable for the game. Okay, so as promised, I would like to um, share with you guys my uh, PvP team. Tag PvP team. So more or less, you'll have an idea on what what is the mix that i have right now i'm i'm actually now at at, at uh, what they call this at uh, master one but um i previous this i was actually at grand already so first time at master one for tag pvp and also grand so if you can see my team first team would be c 
I have here Ramji, Iris, Garf, Rudley, and Annie. So more or less in terms of um, in terms of uh, PvP only, I would usually sh swap out Ramji with Schmidt. So I took out Schmidt here. I put him here in my team two with Janai, Shell. Adams and Dorka and on my third team would be a mix of Greenland and um, North Von Frosty. So this actually combination works because um, I most of them I have especially for team two I have um, I have invested a niche potential for them including Dorka I think one two three all four of them I already finished for a niche potential it's only Adams that I'm working on now for this group, um, I think I finished already. For this group, not that much. So that is my PvP status for the meantime. So that is it, guys. Um, for now, I'm enjoying PvP. I'm usually in Grand. Um, for PvP tag, I'm working my way to Grand um, by tomorrow, by Monday. Or so, sorry, by Sunday so that I can finish by Grand. And more or less right now in terms of um, in terms of the group that I have, I'm happy. I'm. It's really hard to f to farm um for farm uh materials to level up, uh, also and also for a niche potential. <laughs> it's really hard. Solar seals are you know are a headache to to grind. And yeah, that's it for me. So next my next account uh, account uh, preview or review would be um april so april may may june at around july so july i will be nearing my one year here in this channel so i'll be reviewing um that or this account again um uh, before i turn one year or yeah before i turn one year in this channel so more or less, um, a very big progress for me in terms of uh, where my team is now and what have I been doing in terms of uh, my core, uh, um, the core, core of five and core of fifteen. So I suggest you guys, if you are, if you are beginners or mid-level players, focus on just focus on your core units of five. Then. Um, ultimately build it to 15 um, that would be enough for you in terms of pvp tag you could actually mix and match already 15 is actually a big group to more or less um, work with and to level up but you'll get there eventually okay so anyway um, for comments suggestions on my account please write them down below in the comment section and also um for those who haven't subscribed yet uh, uh more or less 85 percent again of my viewers haven't subscribed so this really helps me um i'm on my way to 800 subs so again um a lot of love a lot of help um is is what i need for this channel and um, hope to arrive at a thousand in a, in a few months and uh, again guys Take care, stay safe. This is the Warden, and I'm out of here.